Hey, what is going on pros and pros? It's Mr. Lyman HD here, and welcome to another drinks review. Today, we reviewed Fanta, and this one is gonna be in the strawberry and kiwi flavor. So I believe I got this one out of a random corner shop, and I can't remember the price, but it was, I think it was like uh, one pound to two pounds. I had this for quite a while now. Uh, but regardless, this one is a, uh, I think it's a Denmark, Denmark Fanta, judging from the language on the back. And we'll get to that in a second. So yeah, let's give you guys a 4360 of the packaging. So we have most of the can being red. And then of course we have the kind of new updated Fanta design and logo on the front. That looks very different to how it uh, used to look. We have a picture of a kiwi on there and a strawberry. We have a picture of a leaf. Of course we have the strawberry and kiwi. What does that say? That says, oh yeah, it's non-English. So whatever that says. We have the uh, stuff down there on the bottom. And then we have the ingredients and stuff on the back. On the bottom, everything is all standard, and on the top, everything is all standard and silver, including the pull ring. So let's take a closer look at the drink. So strawberry and kiwi, it sounds really nice coming from Fanta, so hopefully it is, um, it's gonna be no fruit twist though, is it? So these are full sugar, and it's 10.2 grams of sugar per 100 mil, and the total can, which is 330 mil, contains 34 grams of sugar. Apart from that, there's actually nothing else on the can. Uh, oh, Carlsberg, Dan, Denmark, Cabenhaven, DK. That's interesting because it's got Carlsberg, and then it's got Fanta, and it's got Coca-Cola. Obviously, Fanta's owned by Coke, but they both buy owned by Carlsberg. Who knows? Uh, unless that's just a represent out there. But anyways, there's literally nothing else on the can. So it's nice and cold. I have got a cup. Let's just drain to it. Hopefully, it won't explode over me. So I'm guessing the colour's going to be red on this. And the smell and taste, well, it's probably going to smell and taste of strawberries more than kiwis because generally strawberries are cheaper, more powerful fruit, but we'll have to find out. Just don't explode over me. Don't you dare. There we go. Okay, okay, we kind of guessed the colour, so quite a lot of fizz on there. I found that this seems to be really quite fizzy bubbles going fairly fast but there was a lot of uh, foam on the top there bubbles on the side there's not too many bubbles on the side to be honest with you now the color is it's it is cloudy but it's you know it's not like really really i can see a bit of light behind this it's not 100 percent on see through it's, it's just more cloudy than anything else but the color is indeed red so i couldn't smell it while pouring it out so let's give it a closer smell now Oh God, yeah, smells of strawberries. And there is a hint of kiwi smell in there, which is quite nice. And I like kiwis as a fruit. I really like kiwis and strawberries. That's quite nice. Yeah, you get strawberry at the front and you get that kiwi, kiwi kind of hint as well behind. Mm. Yeah, it actually smells, smells real, it smells nice, it smells fairly sweet, it smells nice and strong. Anyways guys, let's taste some. Hmm. Okay, straight away, you know it's not an American fan now because it's nowhere near as syrupy as the American fan does. So that's that's a start. You, you can definitely tell this ain't an American style one at all. There's just not much there. That's why I'm trying to drink more so I can give you guys a description of it. There's not much flavour there whatsoever. There's just nothing there. Wow, that is weak. Okay, guys, so like I said, straight away, nothing like the American Fanta's. We all know the American Fanta's are super syrupy and got the high fructose corn syrup. This isn't the case with this one or the British Fanta's. But straight away, even though it's full sugar, that doesn't, again, it's not as sweet as the American ones, but you wouldn't think it's full sugar. It just doesn't seem as sweet as it should be and again i could go back to the american ones but we'll leave them on a separate side because they are just totally different so it just doesn't seem as sweet as a full sugar fizzy drink like it like it should be here in england or europe it just there's barely any sweetness there which is weird i mean it's still like i don't know you would honestly think that's maybe sugar free because you know you guys have had probably sugar free drinks here and there and they 
they can taste quite sweet. I honestly won't think that's got sugar in it, which is interesting. But anyways, the flavour, yeah, it's a very weak flavour. I had to keep drinking and drinking that, you know, to, to try and figure out whether there's anything there. And there just isn't. Like, it's a really weak flavour. The fizz is average. It isn't overly fizzy like Coke, to be fair. It's about average. But it's... That, I just I just can't I don't understand why there's barely any any flavour in that. It's like, it's like there's. It's almost like getting a fizzy, I guess, fizzy water and adding a couple of drops of you know strawberry or kind of kiwi juice or whatever in it. it it's that weak. It's not like you know if you drink Fanta orange, you know, or Fanta, I'm sure everyone's had Fanta fruit twist. I'm sure all of you have tried Fanta fruit twist. Uh, we all know how nice that tastes, right? And how strong that tastes, you know, for what it is. Like, this is nowhere near that level again. I don't know whether it, the Fanta out there, you know, in Denmark or Denmark, is that kind of style indifferent. If it is, then fair enough. But regardless, it's just not got a strong flavour. There's no weird taste, to be fair. There's no, like, weird, there's no weird, like, chemical taste or anything like that. It's just the flavour is super, super weak, which I just don't get. I just, there's, if anything, there's almost no strawberry flavour and you get a list, absolutely teeniest bit of kiwi in there. And like I said, I keep drinking more to try and get the flavour and nothing's in there. It's like I'm just drinking flavourless sugar almost. That's, that's really disappointed with that. There's, there's literally next to none strawberry flavour, honestly. I literally drink it, you get kind of just nothing and then you get weird little bit of kiwi at the end and that's it. Aftertaste is, is nothing either. That's just nothing there. Just a weird kiwi taste at the end. Ah, that's a bit of a disappointment. Hmm, I expect that to be a bit nicer than that. And for it being full sugar. Hmm, not impressed at all with that guys. I will give that a thumbs down. Strawberry kiwi, I expected better. That's not great. But as always guys, thank you for watching and I'll see you all later.